Bonifacio Global City, also known as BGC, Global City, or The Fort, is a financial and lifestyle district in Metro Manila, Philippines. It is located 11 kilometers (6.8 miles) southeast of the center of Manila. The district experienced commercial growth following the sale of military land by the Bases Conversion and Development Authority (BCDA). The entire district used to be the part of the main Philippine Army camp. It is under the administration of the city government of Taguig. The local governments of Makati and Pateros also claims jurisdiction. In February 7, 1995, Bonifacio Land Development Corporation BLDC, started planning a major urban development, Bonifacio Global City. BLDC made a successful bid to become BCDA's partner in the development of the district. The Ayala Corporation through Ayala Land, Inc., and Evergreen Holdings, Inc. of the Campos Group, purchased a controlling stake in BLDC from Metro Pacific in 2003. BCDA and the two companies now control Fort Bonifacio Development Corporation, which oversees the master planning of Bonifacio Global City. History During the American colonial period, the U.S. government acquired a 25.78 square kilometer property within what was then disputed area between Makati, Taguig and Pateros for military purposes. This area TCT dated 1902, was turned into a camp then known as Fort William McKinley after the 25th U.S. President, William McKinley. After the Philippines gained its political independence from the United States on July 4, 1946, the U.S. bestowed to the Republic of the Philippines all rights of possession, jurisdiction, supervision and control over the Philippine territory except the use of their military bases. On May 14, 1949, Fort McKinley was turned over to the Philippine government by virtue of U.S. Embassy Note No. 0570, under the AFP leadership of Gen. Alfonso Arellano, Fort McKinley was made the permanent headquarters of the Philippine Army in 1957 and was subsequently renamed Fort Bonifacio, after the father of the Philippine Revolution against Spain, Andres Bonifacio, whose father, Santiago Bonifacio, was a native of Taguig, then part of the province of Manila, Tondo. On December 9, 1937 the deed of absolute sale executed by the owner, Don Anacleto Madrigal Acopiado in favor of the American government covering the area of 100 hectares, portion of Bicutan, Taguig, annotated at the back of TCT No. 408. During the American Commonwealth, it was converted to a military base, named Fort McKinley. It was during the presidency of the late President Ferdinand E. Marcos. Administration when Fort McKinley was renamed Fort Bonifacio and transferred to Makati. Taguig got the jurisdiction over Fort Bonifacio after winning the case against Makati and filed in the Pasig Regional Trial Court in 1993. Makati appealed the ruling, but the Pasig RTC in 2011 still sided with Taguig, saying that Fort Bonifacio, including the Embo Barangays, are all part of Taguig. Makati then asked the Court of Appeals to review the case. The Court of Appeals overturned the Pasig Regional Trial Court's decision and reverted jurisdiction of the BGC in favor of Makati. As of date, Taguig has filed a motion of reconsideration at the Court of Appeals seeking to revert the decision. Status quo, meaning the latest ruling, remains with Makati. Taguig currently has de facto control over the area. In February 7, 1995, Bonifacio Land Development Corporation, a consortium led by Metro Pacific, made a successful bid to become BCDA's partner in the development of Bonifacio Global City, BGC, the home of Passionate Minds. Ayala Land, Inc. and Evergreen Holdings, Inc. of the Campos Group, purchased a controlling stake in BLDC from Metro Pacific in 2003. BCDA and the two companies control Fort Bonifacio Development Corporation, which oversees the master planning of Bonifacio Global City. The Bonifacio Global City is a rich district with a high number of skyscrapers, even as the city is still rising. Many skyscrapers are under construction and will be built in future. Description Bonifacio Global City is between EDSA and C5 Road. 
There are seven major access points, access from the north and west through Calayan Avenue which connects it to the North Gate and the Calayan Flyover, access from Taguig in the west via EDSA through McKinley Road and to the McKinley Gate, the three main entrances Upper East Gate, Sampaguita Gate, and Lower East Gate from C5 Highway in the east, and from the airport through the Villamore Airbase to the South Gate by Fifth Avenue and Lawton Avenue. BGC is home to residential condominiums such as 8 Forbes Town Road, Bellagio, Ascensa, Surendra, Pacific Plaza Towers, 1 McKinley Place, the Lux Residences, Bonifacio Ridge Twin Towers, and Regent Parkway and corporate office buildings such as Net One and Bonifacio Technology Center. Many Filipino and multinational corporations have acquired properties and have committed to relocate their global, regional or national headquarters in the business district. Developments Bonifacio High Street The Bonifacio High Street forms the physical core of the Bonifacio Global City and is essentially designed as a 3 by 3 matrix of high-tech offices and residential buildings, retail outlets and pedestrian-friendly roads and walkways. The grid approach ensures a city center that is easy to navigate. The 5th and 11th Avenues and 32nd and 26th Streets serve as the boundaries of the city center. At the north, the 1 Bonifacio High Street, where the PSE Tower, which houses the unified trading floor of the Philippine Stock Exchange, along with the Shangri-La at the fort, Manila is also located here. The retail promenade which encompasses the 29th Street is characterized by landscaped areas. Its design concept is centered on an east-west central access with business establishments and activity pods. It offers retail at the ground level and offices at the second floor. The city square blocks feature landscaped areas and parks. North Bonifacio the P-20 Billion Tower was estimated to start construction by late 2008, by Federal Land, Inc., led by its president Alfred Tai, on a 27-hectare North Bonifacio district lot jointly owned by the Metrobank Group of Companies and the Basis Conversion Development Authority. The tower is the 65-story Gran Hyatt Manila which currently is one of the tallest skyscrapers in Metro Manila, beside that is the Grand Hyatt Manila Residences. Forbes Town Center the Forbes Town Center is Megaworld's 5-hectare township community, where 8 Forbes Town Road, Forbeswood Heights, Forbeswood Park Lane and Bellagio condominiums are. It has a combination of low-density residential development, shopping strip, dining outlets, and other service facilities. Uptown Bonifacio Uptown Bonifacio is a new 15-hectare property located in the northern district of Fort Bonifacio. Megaworld Corporation plans to build new residential condominiums, Uptown Park Suites, Uptown Ritz and one Uptown Residence, and mixed-use business and commercial developments in the area that cater to upper to middle class markets. The area is near the zone where the British, Japanese, and American international schools, and other local schools are located. McKinley Hill among Megaworld's development projects in Metro Manila, the 50-hectare McKinley Hill is by far the biggest, where the Venice Luxury Residences, Viceroy and the Florence Condominiums are located. Situated in Barangay Pinagsama in Taguig, McKinley Hill has over 4,713 condominium units in 34 residential condominium buildings, 482 residential lots, and close to 300,000 square meters of office space spread across 17 offices. There are three international schools, which are the Chinese International School Manila, the first English Mandarin bilingual school in the country, the management school Enderun Colleges, which is partnered with Les Roche International School of Hotel Management in Switzerland, Alain Ducasse education in France and Thunderbird School of Global Management in the United States, and the Korean International School Philippines, the first in the country. McKinley West McKinley West is a 34.5-hectare township by Megaworld, where St. Moritz Condominium is located. Turnover of the project is 2019. Heritage Park Heritage Park was developed by BCDA. 
It is a 76-hectare high-value, multi-use memorial park designed with landmarks and equipped with interment services, crematory and other facilities situated in Barangay Pinagsama. The park opened in the first quarter of 2001. Heritage Park is located along Bayani Road. It is between Libingan ng Mga Bayani and the Manila American Cemetery and Memorial. Historical sites The Fort Bonifacio Tunnel, Bonifacio War Tunnel is a tunnel in Bonifacio Global City, a district of Metro Manila, Philippines. It is considered to be a historical site by the Basis Conversion Development Authority. It is situated at the property of former military base Fort Bonifacio and now called Bonifacio Global City. It has since become hidden underneath the streets that traverse C5 and Calayan Avenue. The Libingan ng Mga Bayani Heroes Cemetery, is a memorial ground housing 33,520 Filipino soldiers killed in Bataan, Corregidor and other battlefields in World War II. Presidents of the Philippines, national artists and other Filipinos deemed honorable are also buried here. The Vietnam War Memorial and Korean War Memorial are located in the Libingan ng Mga Bayani. The Manila American Cemetery and Memorial is on a prominent plateau in the limits of Fort Bonifacio. It contains the largest number of graves 17,206 of American soldiers who fought in World War II. Most of the soldiers buried at the American Cemetery lost their lives in operations in New Guinea and the Philippines. Health and Education St. Luke's Medical Center, Inc. operates a hospital at the Bonifacio Global City. BGC has several major educational institutions, mostly located at the University Parkway District. The University of the Philippines System through the constituent units of UP Diliman and UP Open University and De La Salle University are two most prominent universities which offer graduate programs for professionals working in the district. Other educational institutions in the area include the Leaders International Christian School of Manila, British School Manila, International School Manila, Manila Japanese School, Korean International School Philippines, Everest Academy Manila, STI College, and MGC New Life Christian Academy, Global City, Treston International College. Transport Bonifacio Transport Corporation maintains bus routes BGC bus, serving the business district, as well as jeepneys and UV Express, with a terminal located at the market. Market The Bonfacio Global City is also located near the Bundia MRT station, and will serve the future Metro Manila subway. Fort Bonifacio Dispute the city governments of Makati and Taguig have recently fought over the jurisdiction of Fort Bonifacio because of the area's growth potential. A portion of the base, including the Libingan ng Mga Bayani and the American Cemetery, lies within Taguig, while the northern portion where the global city development is centered was considered part of Makati. A 2003 ruling by a judge in the Pasig Regional Trial Court upheld the jurisdiction of Taguig over the entirety of Fort Bonifacio, including the Bonifacio Global City and Pinagsama. Ruling The Supreme Court on June 27, 2008, per Leonardo Quisimbing, dismissed the suit of the Makati, seeking to nullify Special Patents 3,595 and 3,596 signed by Fidel Ramos conveying to the Basis Conversion and Development Authority public land in Fort Bonifacio, Taguig City. Due to a pending civil case filed by the Taguig City government asking the court to define its territorial boundaries, Makati cannot halt Taguig from collecting taxes on land located in Fort Bonifacio because it does not have any other sufficient source of sufficient income. Reclaim by Pateros the municipality of Pateros, the only municipality in Metro Manila and located near Fort Bonifacio, claims that its original land area was not its present land area of 2.10 square kilometers but 1,040 hectares 10.4 square kilometers including Fort Bonifacio, particularly Barangays Comembo, Pembo, East Rembo, West Rembo, Sembo, South Sembo and Pitigo which are now part of Makati City and Bonifacio Global City, Aranay, Yusuzan and Pilar, Pinag 
Tagsama which was made part of Taguig, based on documents and official maps obtained from some libraries and offices including USA Library of Congress and USA Archives. Susi ng Pateros Newsletter. 2000 Pateros Decrease in territory was accounted to a cadastral mapping in Metro Manila conducted in 1978. The late Pateros Mayor Nestor Ponce challenged the map through an objection letter dated June 23, 1978. In January 1986, former President Ferdinand Marcos issued Proclamation No. 2475 which stated that Fort Bonifacio is in Makati and it S open for disposition. Because of that, a boundary dispute arose which moved Pateros to request a dialogue about that with then Municipal Council of Makati in 1990. Pateros also filed a complaint against Taguig at the Makati RTC in 1996 but the trial court dismissed the case for lack of jurisdiction. The case was moved to the Court of Appeals in 2003, but was denied. The same case was moved to the Supreme Court in 2009, and it was denied again. Supreme Court decision The Supreme Court, on June 16, 2009, per Antonio Eduardo B. Nachira denied Patero's petition against Taguig but ruled out that the boundary dispute should be settled amicably by their respective legislative bodies based on Section 118 of the Local Government Code. Pursuant to the decision, Pateros invited Taguig to a council-to-council -council dialogue on October 8, 2009. Four meetings were held and at the fourth dialogue on November 23, 2009, a joint resolution was made stating that Taguig is requesting a tripartite conference between Pateros, Taguig and Makati. Court of Appeals Decision On August 5, 2013, after just a year and a half, the 20-year-long battle was decided in a 37-page decision that was written by Justice Marlene Gonzalez Sisson of the Court of Appeals. It says that jurisdiction over Fort Bonifacio has reverted to Makati from Taguig. The court upheld the constitutionality of presidential proclamations 2475 and 518, both of which confirmed that portions of the aforementioned military camps are under the jurisdiction of Makati. The decision also cited the fact that voters from the barangays that are subject of the dispute between Makati and Taguig have long been registered as voters of Makati, thus bolstering the former's jurisdiction over Fort Bonifacio. However, Taguig Mayor Lani Cayetano maintained that this decision was not yet final and executory, and asked Justice Gonzalez Sisson to recuse from the case as it was discovered that her family has close ties with the Binays of Makati. Status quo remains. On August 22, 2013, the Taguig City Government filed a motion for reconsideration before the Court of Appeals' S. 6th Division affirming its claim on Fort Bonifacio. With the filing of the said motion for reconsideration, Taguig's jurisdiction forces itself over Fort Bonifacio. According to Taguig's legal department, jurisprudence and the rules of procedure in the country. S. Justice System all say that the filing of a motion for reconsideration suspends the execution of a decision and puts it in limbo. Supreme Court's second decision On August 1, 2016, in a 27-page decision by the Second Division of the Supreme Court, the decision sought Makati government found guilty of direct contempt for abusing the legal processes over the jurisdiction of BGC. Final decision, recognition of Taguig's jurisdiction On October 3, 2017, the Court of Appeals upheld its final decision in favor of the city government of Taguig and not Makati. The SC also sought Makati guilty of forum shopping after simultaneously appealing the Pasig RTC ruling and filing a petition before the CA, both seeking the same relief. Gallery See also Camp Aguinaldo References mb.com.ph mb.com.ph
GR number 157714 sc.judiciary.gov.ph retrieved the 25th of July 2014 external links official website official website of Taguig City Fort Bonifacio from Taguig City blog BGC My City Bonifacio Global City